And uh, another thing there, I wouldn't blame you, Simon, to go back in for an old bullet because it's easier to get an old bullet than to know the truth. It is a hurtful thing. Um, Wally, how did I separate you for 14 months again, dirty, dirty, um, Amory, uh, dirty, well, Amory, and it was dirty Jolene. How did I do that? Because I had no contact with you, son, in 12 years. You have me stalked. You have worksmen t stalking me, never mind you. I wouldn't piss on top of you, son. I wouldn't look at you or look the sight you're on. Never mind to break you off from a woman. I waited nine years in Ireland, son, away from everyone. Over you. Over you, dirt. AIDS victim over you again. Don't throw your dirt, son. Listen. Don't throw your dirt on top of in innocent people. You're round. You are. That's what you're known for. You're like Huey, our home destroyers. Home records, that's what you are. Yeah, dirty sheep dog, yeah. You're waiting 40. Why would you be waiting 14 months for the man to get out? Unless you were guilty. So what did you stop talking to Victoria? She had, your sis, Jolene there put it out on her page that you stopped talking to your sister for eight and a half years. What not over me? So I ain't gone 12 years from you, son. It must be over something else. Because I know nothing about you or anyone belong to you. I'm only after getting out of a hospital and went in and watched the film. And I just received all this to me phone. Yeah, dirty AIDS victim, yeah. Your lie detector testers. Yeah, but you're a false lie detector testers. And another thing, Simon, clear it with Jolene Mahon. Because she's the one that brung it out, son. I only shared it off her page. That's all. Because dirty Amory was pretended to be my friend. I don't want to hurt your feelings, Simon. I swear me mother. I know it's a very hurtful thing, son. Because at the end of the day, it is your wife and they are your family. And you were doing nothing to nobody. But Simon, I'm not being ignorant. It is the truth. Don't find me ignorant, Simon. Because Wooly was lying beside me and he had a woman pregnant when he was married to me. That was Dirty Jolene, Cecil Crumlish's wife. So Jolene Mutton found all that out. Her family lives there in Kent. So if you've nothing to prove with anybody, Simon, I'm here in England myself, Simon. I'm only a couple of miles over the road from you, son. I've nothing to hide from anybody, to be honest. That's all I have to say. I've no penguins' legs, Dirt. You're the fella had two bacon shanks for legs. Which are no dick in you. You've a fanny, you see. That's why you're going around trying to break up people's homes and take their families. Because you can't give birth to one. You're going around with four black children. Three black children. <laughs> and you're claiming to be a daddy of another one. I got you tested, son. I gave nearly ten, £10,000 before I walked out from you. And you had no sperm. You had an operation when you were a child for your man part, son. You got a kick of a horse when you were four year old. And I've me to talk about you. And let not to be a father around me. <laughs> I don't want to get into details today. Yeah, dirty AIDS victim from Longford, yeah. Willie Doherty.